mother beat me, and you deserve all the credit you can get. What does your mother have to do with this? She got you the papers you needed from my files. How else would you have known where the babies were? I don't mean to take any credit away from you. You found them. You gathered up the baby's mother, and you took her to where the children were. Now, that was the touch I really admired. You're a classy dame. I knew you were really sharp, but I had no idea you were this sharp. My hat's off to you, woman. Incidentally, how much of all this does Gary know about? How much do you think Gary knows? Brilliant. What an artist you are. You pulled it off and nobody knows. Nobody except me, of course. You heard him, Blake. You're finished. You've lost everything. And I now own this house. This house? Are you insane? Oh, no. I'm perfectly sane. So take this junk and your blonde tramp and get out of my home. You are insane. This isn't your house and it's never going to be. Oh, you're so wrong. It's all mine, Blake. And I have the papers to prove it. Papers? What papers? What are you talking about? I bought all of your holdings, including this house. And there's absolutely nothing you can do about it. Damn you, Alexis! I'm gonna kill you! Don't! Don't! Please! Please! Help! How are you, Pam? I haven't seen you in some time. I'm not in the mood to exchange pleasantries with you, JR, and I'm sure you don't really care how I am. Well, of course I care. You're still part of the family. Oh, say that nonsense for somebody who doesn't know you. You don't care about anyone, including your family. I saw Sue Ellen this morning. Well, I've never felt the need to explain anything to you before, but I will. I know you're close to her. I don't want to hear your story. I know what happened. And it's happened before. Sue Ellen wasn't enough for you, so you fell in bed with the first available woman. Now, climb down off your soapbox, honey. What were you doing in the south of France with Mark Grayson holding hands? Shut up, J.R., and stay out of my life. Who gave you the right to poke your nose in my life? Just leave me alone. No, no, you started this, my sanctimonious little sister-in-law. Where the hell were you when your husband needed you the most, huh? Now, you couldn't take the battle for Ewing all, could you? Now, you didn't approve. So you left him high and dry and ran off to the south of France with your favorite stud for a long, luxurious roll in the hay to calm your little hurts. Now, tell me. Was Mark Grayson the only one? Or did you try a few Frenchmen just because you were there? Phyllis, tell Bobby I was here. Yes, Pam. Pam, I hate that one. <laughs> father's eyes, doesn't he? How did you find out? I can't remember when I wasn't one step ahead of you. Here, take him. Come here, baby. Now, don't squash him. You're gonna tell Chase and Maggie, aren't you? And ease Chase's mind? Don't be silly. He's yours. Your little secret. And my little secret. <laughs> in touch, Melissa.